was sad all of a sudden for no reason i tried thinking about it why the reason for my sadness and then i started making some victories i made a lot of them then after that i started roaming on the internet and i came across this hadith that i would say it is a sign that allah brought before my eyes that all of a sudden my sadness just went away and i just focused on the hadith trying to understand what allah is telling us or what the prophet peace be upon him is trying to tell us in this hadith it is narrated by anas bin malik that the prophet peace be upon him said whoever makes the hereafter his goal Allah makes his heart rich and organize his affairs and the world comes to him whether he wants it or not. And then he continued to say, and whoever makes the world his goal, Allah put his poverty right before his eyes and disorganized his affairs. And the world does not come to him except what has been decreed for him. I mean, this is so deep and I kept on thinking about it. And for one thing, guys, if we will bear witness, it's kind of human nature in general. We are never satisfied with anything. Man is never satisfied. The moment you want A, you are thinking about B. The moment you get B, you are thinking about C. So the poverty right before his eyes here, I got to understand it in this sense that if you are chasing the dunya, you will never be satisfied because the moment you get what you are looking for, you are looking for something else. So you always feel like you are empty. You always feel like you have nothing since what you are looking for you haven't got it yet you feel like I have nothing you are never satisfied and on the other hand if the hereafter is your goal definitely you don't care about anything in this dunya that's what does Allah do he he makes you so satisfied with even the little that you have you are so content it's with even if you you have nothing you feel like you have everything because that is not where the concentration is allah makes things so easy for you and you feel like i have everything already because allah said he will hurt he will bring the world to you even if you like it or not and I, we've witnessed this. Those who are so religious, who don't care about anything, they are satisfied with their life. They are living their life. So what I've got to understand is, if you want to enjoy both worlds, this dunya and the hereafter, make the hereafter your goal. Try to satisfy Allah and he will make you everything easy for you as this hadith is saying in this dunya that if we keep on chasing this dunya we are never going to be satisfied and before we realize the hour is here already guys may Allah give us understanding and may Allah give us the strength to worship him as we are supposed to assalamu alaikum